All right, something interesting. Music, jewelry box, etc. What's etc? Oh, you guys! Is this all Lennox? 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 Some of my worst memories: storage lockering. Just when it's been raining. Yeah, it's still fun. Previously on Locker Nuts, I purchased a huge unit for $800 to find out why all the items were stacked only on the left side. The unit has produced some exciting and valuable pieces such as Disney Lennox collectibles, a Hope Chest time capsule, a rare trumpet, and a limited edition Kermit the Frog replica. Now it's time to go through the last of the boxes and see what we find. Yeah, I thought we were safe from Mother Nature, but we're still going to be battling it out for a little bit. It's raining, but I was prepared. I had the tarp all ready to go. Alrighty, where were we? Okay, I see some interesting stuff in here. Do you see stuff in here? Is this, is this too dark in here? Because once the sun went away, it got a little bit darker. My eyes haven't adjusted. Hopefully the camera has. The miscellaneous grab bag here. Oh, we need those, though. At home. Um... <laughs> Mickey Mouse. That's got some good stuff in there. That's not what I was interested in. Uh oh, oh. What is this? It looks like a brass dragon. Do you see that? Or is this copper? Made in China, 1982. Gates General Corp. Corp. Um, it appears to be a dragon, and I would say it's brass, but. I know brass has copper in it, but I don't know, does brass get a, develop a patina like that? It doesn't look like copper, it looks like brass, but I've never seen a patina like that. Where's the rest of it though? There's a good sharpening stone, that was three bucks at the flea market. Right, so where's the, oh yeah, look at that. Huh, is this mouth chip? No, nope, that's just the design. Huh. We need a tail. Yep. Dang, that's that is cool. So this goes here. And this goes here. Very nice piece. But what is it for? What is that for? That is pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. Hmm. That's wow, it's really Oh, man, the tarp blew off. Son of a gun. Woo, can you hear that? I don't know if you can hear that. It's coming down pretty good. I, what? It said thunder, lightning, hail. And then it said nothing. And now it's something. And even the wind kind of picked up for a second. It blew the tarp off. I had to go put the tarp back on. I stuffed it in a little tighter this time. There was no wind all of a sudden. But anyways, this guy is ugh, it's heavy too that is legit that's legit that's a good little find i don't even know how to price something like that but this is gonna go in my prize pile right here <laughs> all right i just got a snapshot of what the weather forecast is it does not show this all right it does not show this and this is a real bummer because even though i have a tarp on there eh, the tarp doesn't always keep the stuff dry. That tarp's a little bit old. Huh, that's interesting. They're good utensils. I mean, they're in great shape. Really nice selection here. They're all dollar items. Huh. Lock. Oh, look at that. There's another lock. Cylinder lock. That's good. Seeds. <laughs> I don't know if you're even hearing me talk, but it, it is like deafening this sound. It's so loud. Oh my goodness, it's even getting louder. All right, what's left in here is a whole bunch of locks. That's, that's pretty good find. 
And the reason why it's gotten uh, very, very loud is because you can see there's hail. So it really did start to hail. There's a little bit of hail. It's mostly rain, but there's a little bit of hail. You can see the little pieces here. Every now and then I see one bouncing around. The weather's definitely fluctuating great, greatly because, uh, well, I had to take my jacket off because the sun was out and it actually got hot. I started sweating like crazy. And now the, the temperature is just plummeted. I knew today was going to be challenging. I did, but then I thought I got lucky. And, uh, nope. Didn't get lucky. The weather report just got wrong. <laughs> oh, here it goes again. Look at it. It's even coming off the side here. Wow, 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 wow. Whoa. Look at that. That's hail. That's crazy. I hope that car doesn't blow off this time because I don't want to go out there. I'm going to get soaked. And my jacket's in the car. <laughs> Good times. Good times. At least the hail stopped. I think that it's uh, pretty bad, but it keeps getting worse. Look at the size of the hail balls on this uh, Sun's out and it's crazy. Here we go. Next box. Alright, this appears to be light fixture. Look at that. A blender with a uh, serving spout on it. <laughs> Margarita time! Next box, open puzzle. Got a plate with Bambi. Oh, another one, yay. Foxes this time. That's cool. We don't call 911. <laughs> That's pretty cute. Let's get a little dog leash right there. These people with their plates. The snow leopard. I thought on these plates, I saw, I looked them up on eBay. I see a bunch of them listed, but I don't see not one recently sold in 90 days. Ooh. There's some thunder. Thunder. Na 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 na. Sun's out here. Clouds are dark and ominous there. This guy here. And this is, looks to be a couple of Christmas decorations. Ooh, no, that's what it is, but. Wait a second, this guy's kind of interesting. Not some fat Santa Claus. This is like a. It's like some kind of fairy or troll or something. It's another fairy looking dude. 7298. Thunder just keeps rolling in. I wonder if it's a good idea to be under a metal roof. I'm in a lightning storm. Okay, here's that wood box that we saw I thought it was bigger uh, but it's not this is the size <laughs> it is but as we learned from the safe opening video bigger is not always better is it the little safe was the one that had the goods all right let's take hmm. what can you even see that it's kind of dark in this unit it's the storm that's what it is it's wood Maybe they're making, they need to plan to make some crafts out of it or something. That's all there is in here. That's a real disappointment. The box is nice though. The box is actually really cool. What is this? Huh, look at that. Shaggy. All right, from Scooby-Doo. What's that say on there? I think it says 1989. 
This is something right there, 1989, I think. There's another one. Okay. Uh, see, th this kind of stuff here, I just don't really care to find. Uh, I don't even think it sells that well at the flea market. We're going to find out. But... It's five dollars new. I mean, if I get a dollar for it, seem like I, I really would be happy with that. I don't think I'm gonna get a dollar. What's this guy? Another toy. I like the toys. We do sell those. Have no problem selling those at the flea market. This glass ball. Um, with pandas. That is interesting. It's different. Oh, that's probably goes on there. Definitely looks like it. But what's the hole for? Some other part to that. Another little bear guy. This one looks homemade, maybe. Mm, I don't know. Hey, he looks like the East Coast guys on their video. Don't they make that face every time they find something or don't find something? That's that's like Jeremy and Jeebus's O face, right there. I'm pretty sure. Hey, maybe I'll save that for them when they come to town in a few days. Guys, you will not believe what I just found in this locker right here. I'm pretty sure this is from the East Coast. Because see that look on his face? What every East Coast YouTube guy looks like in their thumbnails. The East Coast O face. You'll see it here next week when they come to town for a collab. But here's what I got for them. Boom! That's right. West Coast rules. All right, back to it. Had a little fun with that bear for a second there. And another one. Ooh, that's nice. But it's empty. Oh, that's cool. I mean, India, I'm sure that's silver plate. Dang, it's another Lennox piece. Trick and treat. That's crazy. It's crazy that it's just like stuffed in the, this thing. <laughs> it's a nice little piece though. Oh, doo -doo -doo -doo. oh, that's cool. Muppets. And there's Scooby Doo. I don't know if those are worth anything, but at least those are exciting. Oh, dang it. I didn't do that either. Look at that. Tinkerbell. Snap off. That's another stinking Lennox piece. Good form. Wow, that's really a shame. I think I could uh, glue that. It's, like I said, it's just it so surprising. Some of the pieces are like overly wrapped up. Like, overkill. And then other pieces really aren't appropriately protected and they get damaged and that was a Lennox piece all right oh there's another east coast oak face right there oh huh. all right what are those made in china hmm. Two of them. Kermit. Tycho. I was just saying I'm not really into stuffed animals, but this guy I might actually look at, especially since the other ones worth so much money. Oh, these guys. We already had a couple of these. I already sold a couple of those at the, at the uh, garage sale. Okay. I heard some coins. Yeah, we heard some rocks. Boy, more rocks. Wow, look at these. So cool. <laughs> and then there's that. Not cool. That's a nice mug. Look at that. I've never seen one like that before. Look at that. It's not hollow. Just get your hand right in there. 
It's pretty cool. We'll get this here. wind instrument, I think. Boy, that sounds nice. Okay, I'm gonna have to look that up too. <laughs> I must say, I am really enjoying this uh, this locker overall. Oh, um, it's a candle making. This is, I think this is for candle making right here. That's what it is. See the wick? You run the wick out, I think, out there. You fill the hot wax in there and you make a candle. Uh, maybe I'm wrong, but I think that's what it is. This is all candle wax right here. That's nice. This may all be candle making stuff. Right here. Okay, candle creations. So I think what you do, you put the wax in here. Plug it in, heats up. Where's it gonna come out of down here? Probably. Probably comes out right here, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. What's this? Ultraviolet light. Hmm. UV light. You your ultraviolet light. That's interesting because I believe ultraviolet light is what you use to test jade to see if it's real. And look, look at this big old chunk of wax. Look what this is. Oh wow, look at this. There's some old photographs. Ooh, super old. Oh. Look at that. Huh, that's neat. There's some really old ones. Look at that. Look at this one. I love the oval format. Look at that one. Very cool. That's some nice photos. These are old photos they sell. We've got a three headed dog. What's that guy's name? Oh, it's from Harry Potter. Huh. Okay. Harry Potter stuff's been selling pretty good. It's $25 the gun. My name is Fluffy. Hmm. Is that right? His name is Fluffy, huh? It's a new product. What is it? What is it? Vacuum sealer. Oh, it's one of those food savers. It's brand new, though. Like, I just opened it for the first time. Seal and save, it says. Um, you know what? I'm going to look that up real quick. See if we've got some value. Our food saver, $48.65. None of them have sold recently, but there's one for sale for $65 pre-owned and one for sale for $197 pre-owned. So I think I might take this back and go ahead and list this because it is in the box. The box looks okay. It's like it is a little bit of damage on the box up here. But it's not too terrible. I can just slap a label right on this and ship it out if I can uh, get a buyer. But that might be like a hundred dollar item potentially. What is this? I just found a million dollars. Psych! There's a Lennox. Dang! Tinkerbell's head snapped off. It was me. This is, this is something. So any, these little voice recorders are actually, they hold their value. And some of them are decent. Like this is probably 15 or 20 bucks right here. And Sony is the brand that you want. Look at all those little tapes too. Look at that. Oh, 
second. Right down here. A dollar bill. And this little protector case with the Cheshire cat right there. So what's significant about this dollar bill, I wonder? It's 2001. Here's the thing though, when you sell this, you want to keep these with it. Even if they're used, they still sell and you get a little bit more money. Uh, look at that. Old iron, right? I think this... Uh... Yeah, I think that's how it goes, like that. So I think what you do is you actually put coals in here. And that was how they... <laughs> Just lifting this thing is like, good grief, man. Those people must have been strong back in the day. Strong, major upper body strength. That doesn't look good. That does not look good at all. Ooh, that's a brain. No, that's not brain. What am I? I don't know what I'm looking at. Sheets and towels, sheets and towels. They hid their money at the bottom. Nope. Oh. You guys. Is this all Lennox? Lennox, Lennox, Lennox. Honey poo, honey poo, honey pot. Votive. Look at this one. This feels empty though. Could be the case for the other pieces that we found. Or have yet to find. Okay. Minnie Mouse's Elegant Evening. Oh, this is the one that we sold. Okay. These are more interesting here. It's from Lennox Collections. And it's never even been opened. That's crazy. I was really hoping that I'd find more Lennox stuff over here. Or just more of the higher end collectible stuff in general. A most adventurous day vase. Look at that. Okay. Like a Beauty and the Beast piece, but it is still pretty. Huh. The Beauty and the Beast was legit because it was numbered. Uh, this, this is not getting. Sorry, guys. This is not getting a real good lighting in this dark box right here. It says it's from the Charm Chick. Crystal ball. It's heavy. This one is heavy. Ooh, this is a real crystal ball. Look at that. That's a real deal right there. And a stand. Huh, look at that. Goes right there. It's pretty cool. Let's see what we got here. Look at that. Huh. Singing display figure. It's Pinocchio. Sings and dances to original Christmas songs. Oh, that's kind of cool. Let's put that aside. Oh, okay. A bunch more puzzles. Oh, I forgot. I nearly forgot this was the locker we got all the Harry Potter stuff out of. There's something. Look at that. Kind of Harry Potter coins. Huh. That could be worth something. Alright, something interesting. Music, jewelry box, etc. What's etc.? Yo. Nope. It is a music box. Books. 
monster load here. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Still gotta pull the tarp back and tie this thing off. It is a monster. And I didn't even nearly get it all. Um, trash. Couch that looks like it should be trash. Big old box of trash. Couple mattresses. And these are all trash, 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 trash. Well, that's, I should probably sell that. I'll slip that up on top. Uh, trash, 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 trash. Bro. So, tomorrow hopefully for a big day at the flea market. <laughs> and then um, I'll stop by here on the way back. I'll try to load the rest of this on there. And then we'll hit the dump. That's the plan. That's the plan anyways. But kind of looking around, this is like a... Man, that's almost a full load right there just on its own. Hopefully I sell a lot tomorrow. Well, I'll see what happens. Some of my worst memories, storage lockering. This one, it's been raining. Yeah, it's still fun. Seriously, another 10 minutes and I would have had this thing tied down and I could be on the road right now. I could tie it down, but I'm gonna get soaking wet. I'm already getting soaking wet. It's just not fun being soaking wet <laughs> look at that can you believe the nerve of mother nature right now to go and throw that rainbow up my face as soon as I'm finished Dang. that one's bright too check it out it's got all kinds of colors in it this is not a very good cover job that is not it is not but I think it's secure that's most important <sighs> that was not easy no one said it would be. Welcome back to Treasure Hunting with Jeebus. No, wait a second. No, no. Welcome back to Locker Nuts. <laughs> All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. This is, what is this, part six. I've been losing count. But whatever it is, we're done going through the stuff. That's it. all this locker had. Tremendous amount of stuff, right? I mean, there was tons of stuff. I didn't even show you everything. I cut out all the boring stuff. Books, paper, like there's a lot of stuff I cut out because it just not it's not that interesting. But I even cut out some interesting stuff because there was just so much interesting stuff. But this is a wrap uh, to going through the stuff. But I am gonna have one more video because I know you guys love to see me summarize it. Well, I'm gonna summarize this as good as I can. There's still a ton of stuff available on the eBay store. If you're interested, go check it out. And there's still quite a few items that I still have yet to list on my eBay store. Um, but I'll get to it. But on the next next video, I am going to summarize what we've sold, maybe show a little bit of what we still have to sell. But there's also an, a special announcement that I'm planning for the next video, and you're going to want to tune in and see it. So if you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe, and make sure to hit the little bell icon that's going to notify you when the next video is up, as well as all the videos that come afterwards. Um, but after this summary video, that's it. All right. That's it for the Stacked on the Left series. We're moving on to other stuff, and we've got a ton of stuff, a ton of stuff coming. And um, just today, this morning, I bought two more lockers at auction. I'm nuts, I'll tell you. I'm nuts. And one of those lockers, however, is really, really interesting, and I'm looking forward to sharing that one with you. It's a hunter's locker, okay? Enough said. But we've got great stuff to come. Next one, though, you're not going to want to miss the summary and the special announcement. All right? Till then, however, good luck to you. God bless you. We'll see you next time on Treasure Hunting with Jeebus. Well, you never know where you're going to see me, but you'll see me next time for sure on Lockin' Nuts.